finally, stage six, the call. This is when your new normal has become living in and sorting through your loved one's collateral damage. You can't escape it. You wake up to 15 text messages demanding your help or berating you for something you failed to do for them. The financial impact is undeniable. Hospital bills, fines, damaged property, stolen property, bail, attempts at treatment, and every band-aid in between. The resentments and wreckage inside your family are endless. Things you never thought would be possible are now daily stresses, like fielding calls from jail, which you have sadly learned is easier than going to bed having no idea where your loved one is. And most disturbing, you're now waiting for the call. The call that tells you your loved one is gone. You stop planning vacations or knowing what it would feel like to let yourself be in the moment or feel happy. If your child is the addict, you actually become jealous and resentful of your spouse and their ability to detach because you can't and the pain is killing you. If your husband is the addict, you feel embarrassed that you did not see this coming sooner and that you thought if you stayed, you could be the one that actually got through to them. 